who am I to say no to a video about Galois theory? Let's go. Let's look at one particular example at the extension of Q adjoined at the seventh root of unity, zeta seven, uh, which is given by this number. This is an algebraic extension, and it is Galois because this polynomial, the seventh uh, power of x minus one, factors as x minus powers of that root of unity. So in other words, that extension is the splitting field of this polynomial. Moreover, there is a general fact that the Galois group of a cyclotomic extension, the extension of Q adjoint uh, an nth root of unity, that Galois group is isomorphic to Z modulo N Z cross, the units in the integers modulo N. Therefore, the Galois group we are looking for, the Galois group of this extension, is isomorphic to Z modulo 7 cross, uh, which, by the way, it's cyclic of order 6. So the Galois group is isomorphic to Z modulo 6. Now, what Galois theory tells me is that sub-extensions of the seventh roots of unity will be in correspondence with subgroups of the, uh, mo the units modulo 7. So uh, the units modulo 7, the full group corresponds to the field at the bottom, Q. Uh, the trivial subgroup that is just the identity modulo 7, that corresponds to the top field. And any other subgroup that I find in between will correspond to whatever sub-extensions are there in between. Now, I said before that the units modulo 7 are cyclic of order 6, so the only subgroups of this group are a group of order 6, a group of order 1, a group of order 3, and a group of order 2. So these are all the subgroups that I have to work with, and these two tell me there will be two intermediary extensions of these Galois extension. So what are those extensions? So this is the picture that we have. This is our full extension, which is Galois with Galois group Z modulo 7 cross. And then there is some other extension of degree 2 K uh, such that the Galois group of this extension is isomorphic to this subgroup of the units modulo 7. And then a, uh, an extension of degree 3 such that the Galois group here is isomorphic to these units modulo 7. And everything is Galois, by the way, because these subgroups, uh, this is abelian, so those groups are normal, so this is also, uh, uh, this is Galois, and this is Galois as well. So the question now is, what is K and what's F? There is a general fact that this square root is always contained in the pth roots of unity. Therefore, if you put P equals to 7 in here, then you find that a square root of minus 7 is contained in the seventh roots of unity, and since this is a quadratic extension, that must be k. Therefore, uh, this is the quadratic extension we were looking for. Since there's only one quadratic extension, that must be it. So the field fixed by this subgroup must be the square root of minus 7. Now, what is f? f is the field of all those elements that are fixed by those Galois elements, and uh, for example, alpha, that is the seventh root of unity plus the one over the seventh root of unity, that is fixed by these elements because of the way uh, the, these elements correspond to automorphisms of the field. So this is fixed, uh, but what is that number? But then alpha is this exponential plus this exponential, and using the usual identity, I get that this is twice the cosine of 2 pi over 7, which is an algebraic number, and it's like an algebraic number of degree 3. Therefore, f must be actually just q adjoined that algebraic number, and this is the cubic extension that I was looking for.